Welcome back into Victoria's Tarot. As promised, I will be looking up the days or tapping into the days from January the 10th up until January the 27th. Now, today I'm just going to go to the 26th. We're going to go backwards from the 27th. And I want to go to January the 26th, the day before Nicola was reported missing. So what's going on January the 26th? January the 26th, Nicola, show me your January the 26th. So right away, what draws me is this Ten of Swords. Whenever I see this card, I just know something's going down, okay? Period. So we have the Empress in reverse. She's overwhelmed about something. She shut down. We have the Three of Pentacles in reverse. Usually this is someone working together. This is teamwork, a learning and teaching moment. This could be about something going on in the community. But it's in the reverse. So this is someone who can't work well with others or somebody being selfish. And then we have the Ten of Swords in the reverse. The failure, the ending, somebody hitting their rock bottom. Tell me more about the 26th, Nicola. What's going on with you on the 26th? What's going on with you on the 26th? So I think it's the situation of Nicola Bailey. This is protecting from any spiritual weapon that tries to prosper against me. Ah, the Emperor. Hmm. Wow. She's overwhelmed and shut down because of this emperor is what I'm seeing, okay? He's in the upright, but she's shut down. Now, this emperor, he's the father figure. He's very calculated, but he can be very controlling and aggressive, stubborn, defensive. He can be all of those things. Let's keep that in mind. Tell me about this Three of Pentacles. Why is the Three of Pentacles in reverse, Nicola? Wow, we really have the two on the board. The 26. The Four of Pentacles of the upright. So somebody can't work with somebody about stability, saving. So this is a financial thing. We went from the three of pentacles in reverse to the four of pentacles in the upright. Can't work well with others. Can't be stable with this person financially. She didn't, She She's not stable financially with Paul. That's what I'm seeing. She's overwhelmed by this. So like we've seen this pattern all through Nicola's readings, there's money issues with Paul all the time. Ten of Swords in reverse spirit. Tell me all this Ten of Swords in reverse. <clears throat> Five of Swords in reverse. So now we're, we have these this failure, this, this ending, this rock bottom clarified by the Five of Swords in reverse. The Five of Swords is going to take us to somebody winning at all costs, taking advantage of a situation. Spirit, tell me more about this failure, this ending. Tell me more about this Ten of Swords. In reverse. Nicola, what can you tell me about this Ten of Swords? January 26. Nine of Pentacles. This is a single energy. She's good with money. 
but it's like she's doing it all on her own. And it's looking like that's who's being taken advantage of. In my opinion, she's being taken advantage of. Which could explain why she's so overwhelmed and shut down about these finances. Somebody is taking advantage of her finances. Tell me more about this three and four of pentacles spirit. More about this three and four of pentacles. Nine of swords in the reverse. Unclear thinking, paranoia, inner turmoil. So yeah, like these finances are definitely becoming an issue. The finances are an issue. Tell me about this empress and this emperor. Tell me about this empress and this emperor. Two of swords all the time. The two of them. Here's the crossroads, the hard decisions, fear of commitment. So although they were in a, whatever this was, relationship, if that's what they want to call it, it's looking like somebody or maybe the two just didn't want to be committed to each other. Number one, I'm seeing her being taken advantage of financially. Like she's a bag for Paul. It starts with her being overwhelmed and shut down. It ends with the single energy. She's a workaholic. She's successful, but for some reason, she's feeling lonely. So this will be in my videos. Remember, this video was for the 26th. I will date it, timestamp it for you guys. We are working our way from the 27th back. We started with the 10th, so now we're going in between. So that's what I have for you guys for the 26th for Nicola Bully and what was going on the day before she went missing. <clears throat> like, share, and subscribe, and I'll see you guys on the next video.